In this video, we will talk about processing of payment of professional tax. So when we process salary, a professional tax of rupees 200 were deducted from each employee. So we are required to make payments towards the same. So in order to process the professional tax payment, at the payment watcher, you need to press Alt A so that payment autofill options can be toggled and over here in the field process for select the option professional tax payment then specify the pay month and specify the employee group which is sales for our example and select the pay head professional tax for the field payroll ledger and specify the method of payment whether cash or through bank so I will select cash over here so here we can see that the professional tax for rupees 400 is calculated. Since we deducted this amount from employees and we are required to pay it to the government so that is why we are making a payment towards professional tax. And after making the payment you need to save the voucher entry by pressing Ctrl A. So that's it. So we are done with the entire payroll process. And to summarize the entire process, we began with defining time units for work like hours, minutes and based on that we created attendance and production types like absent, overtime, present and then we defined all the pay heads like employee earnings, employee deductions and employer's contribution along with uh, pay heads like admin expense and EDLI contribution. So after defining the pay heads we are required to define employee data or we can also define employee groups and define salary structure for each group and then define the employee and assign him to the group. And once we are done with the setup we can record the attendance watchers followed by salary process and after processing the salary we can process employers contribution towards PF, ESI and calculate professional tax.